In the northeastern forest of Bangladesh, a group of scientists are making an effort to study the carnivorous animals. Today, they are exploring the Rema and Kalenga forest, which is also known as the Tharap Hill Reserve Forest. The search for the carnivorous animals is not an easy task. Most of the carnivorous animals are elusive and nocturnal. To find the animals, our group of scientists have to use modern technologies such as camera traps. In a few days, our group of scientists set up some advanced camera traps with infrared vision and motion detection. If there is any movement within the field of view of these cameras, it will automatically start recording. After a few days, when they retrieved the footage from the cameras, they couldn't believe their eyes. They have found a family of small clawed otters. Previously, the small clawed otters were only known to occur at the Sundarbans in the southwest of Bangladesh. For the very first time, the small clawed otters are being filmed outside the Sundarbans. The camera traps have shown that there is at least 30 individuals living in these northeastern forests. The small clawed otters are the smallest of all the 13 species of otters in the world. Apart from the ones in captivity, very little is known about their behavior in the wild. Their diet mostly consists of crabs, insects and other aquatic crustaceans. Being a species of otter, they are also good at fishing. The small clawed otters are categorized as vulnerable by the IUCN. Their population around the world is on a steep decline. Studies have shown that the small clawed otter's population has globally declined by 30% in the past 30 years. They also estimated another 40% population decline by 2070. The biggest threat to the small clawed otter population are habitat loss, pollution, hunting, poaching and etc. Proper study with conservation efforts are vital for saving these species from extinction. As human, it is our responsibility to save our planet along with all of its inhabitants in order to conserve Mother Nature's diversity of life.